are in the newsroom watching a broadcast of bears in our yard. Um, this one we got on this. Okay. Um, yeah, he was. We're we sitting here outside. We're uh, going to say the bears are probably coming mommy. in just a moment. And no. I don't know. So she's in our yard right now. Yeah. And they got Mama's bear video queued up. And they have. That's what I'm doing now. And this is live now. She in our backyard. Waiting for video to go. And Florida. What are you guys doing? Why is that Bud? Did they go to Bud's? Bud's. They did. They were at Bud's earlier. A new app for iPads and smartphones. No. Yeah, we saw you. Oh. Is that up on the iPad? No. That's that's live. Oh, we are a bunch of techies. Oh, Dad, I'm the only one in the show. No, I'm filming. What's that? Oh. Just hours before. She just got scared. Oh, is that a raccoon? Yeah. <laughs> she just, she's live and she just saw a raccoon. No, she's not live. Yeah, they're in the backyard right now. No, that's mm. video, but this is her. I mean, it's time to go. No, because she's practicing. That's what the guys are doing. And then it's going to show up on their one. Alright, thank you. What I, I didn't mean it's live, I mean, this is real. She's yeah. in the backyard right now. Yeah. Oh, she's in the She saw a raccoon. She's practicing. Right, right. But she just saw a raccoon in her backyard, right? <laughs> There's a bear right there, Mitt Romney. That he was paid one point six million dollars. I want to go. I want to go. For their prayer. The Collier County family pet is dead tonight. The family says. The Collier County family pet is dead tonight. The family says. They think the poison was meant for a much bigger animal roaming that neighborhood. Bears. NBC2 Sandra Weathers. Well, we're actually in the spot where a woman spotted a bear about two weeks ago. And they tell us in the next two hours, the bears will probably be coming out of these woods. Now, we won't be here, but neighbors tell us the bears will, wreaking havoc, throwing over trash cans, leaving behind a mess, and leaving some neighbors afraid for their children. One woman says the problem is so bad, she thinks her dog ate poison that was meant for a bear. Yeah. Hey Joe, can you give me a mic check, please? Okay, so you yeah, you're Hmm. Did they go to their house? Joe, you're over my You can turn that up a little bit. I'm about to be so upset. Sorry. This is Mama's video. I understand why you would be afraid of the bear. People have children. But was that fear enough for someone to try to poison a bear? I don't think anybody's trying to purposely harm the animal. But Lynch isn't convinced she took her claim to domestic animal services and now they're invested. There could have been a child that might And that's good. As for the protective black bears, Florida Fish and Wildlife say they're working to stay in the field. Fish and Wildlife will not be the animal. That's their strict policy. Fish and Wildlife will not be the animal. That's their strict policy. They actually are on the weed species list. Now, FWC wants to remind us that people that are trying to harm the bears are trying to harm the bears. Now, FWC wants to remind people not to try and harm or hurt any of these endangered species. Not to try and harm or hurt any of these endangered species. They say if you try to hurt one of these bears, you could face some stiff penalties, including some jail time. Now, as far as the poison dogs, domestic animal services, they're still investigating it. And it's a story we'll continue to follow. For now, we're live in East Naples. Sandra Weathers, NBC2. That was liar from our house, huh? She's done.